Today we're going to be estimating or rounding to the nearest tens place. When you have uh, many numbers that you're trying to add quickly or subtract, um, it's easier to do it when you're, you have nice even round numbers. Not even, but round numbers with lots of zeros in them. And that way you don't need to focus on adding so many digits together. So let's round the number 52 to the nearest tens place. Since we're rounding to the nearest tens place, we're going to skip the 2 because that's in the ones place. And we're going to look at the 5 because that's in the tens place. Okay, That stands for 50. Then we ask ourselves, what are the closest tens to 52? Well, there's 5 tens, 50, and that's a little lower. And the next 10 is 60. Add an extra 10 and you get 60. So which is closer, 60 or 50? And the way to find that out is to look at the next digit in the ones place. You look at this 2, and we look down here at our chart. This is whether we round up or down here. If the digit is 4 or below, we round down. If the digit is 5 or above, we round up. Since it's a 2, we're going to be rounding down. And the answer is 50. Let's look at this one, 369. There's a 9 in the ones place, we'll skip that. And here's our tens place right here. Remember, we're rounding to the nearest tens. So we're looking at this 369 and we're looking at the 60 right here. The closest tens to 369 is either 300, stays the same, 60, or the next 10 after 60 is 70. Notice that I'm not doing anything with the hundreds because we're only rounding to the nearest tens place. We've got 370 or 360. Which is closer? Well, we're going to look at the next digit, and that's a 9. And the 9 right away tells us that we're rounding up. And the answer is 370. Let's look at a little harder one here. Now we have 498. We're going to skip the ones place. And again, since we're rounding to the nearest tens, we're going to look at this 9, which stands for 90. The closest tens is either 400. 90, just to add a zero at the end, or the next 10 up after 9 tens would be 410 Oh, that doesn't work. 10 tens makes an extra 100. So instead of 400, I'm going to put 500 up here. 9 tens, 10 tens, 10 tens makes an extra 100. So instead of 400, I'm going to put 500 up here question is, what's it closer to, 490 or 500? So we look at the next digit, again, same as before, and we see an 8 there. And right away the 8 tells us that we're rounding up. So 500 is our answer for that one. This is just one method of using estimation to the nearest tens place.